Alrighty guys, Sad City Clown back again with something a little bit different today. Um, got my mate Expensive here, and he has just picked up one of these bad boys. Ah! I don't have one, unfortunately. But he picked this up today. Australian release was today, which is the, I don't know what the date is, the 29th. I think they're already out, are they? In yeah, America? Yeah. In Europe, I think. Um, so yeah, this is the box. It's heaps thinner than I thought it was going to be. PS4. I don't think it comes with a game or anything, does it? No, it doesn't. But the Xbox, I think, came with FIFA. So I don't know why. Alright, so on the side you've got... I assume what it comes with. Hopefully you can see some of this. Is that what it comes with? Headphones? Yeah, contents. Yeah. It comes with headphones. That's the... Oh. That's the um, headset, headset. Oh, that's the headset. Looks like headphones. <laughs> okay, so it comes with a headset. Must come with a HD cord this time, which kicks ass. Printed materials, that's handy. Yeah. That'll be your warranty and stuff. Yeah. USB cable and power cord, like all of them would. It says it's jet black, which I think there's only one colour, so that could be a bit of a spoiler for later on. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think that's really it for the box. Oh, no, sorry, the back. What? The back has heaps of stuff on it. Unfortunately, this only, only really has one exclusive title, which was Killzone. So the Xbox definitely has one up on it there. But yeah, other than that, it sort of shows some games that are coming out for it. I'll let Expensive do the honours and open it, because it's his baby. And we may need some cutting utensils. <laughs> one of them. One up there. Expensive has had this pretty well all day and not opened it, just for this video. I don't think I could avoid it. <laughs> which is out of the box. Oh, there is a bit of paper in that box, which is probably just your printed materials. <clears throat> this is pretty cool they've done this this time. So if you get the PS Vita, you can pretty well... As far as I know, I don't know a lot about these. I haven't really looked into them very much. Sorry, I'll get down here. Um, but I'm pretty sure most of the games you can just continue playing on the Vita. Kind of like the Wii U does. So that's just another point why not to buy a Wii U. Yeah. Because <laughs> they're one good thing is gone again. And plus, plus yeah. you can get motion control. On these ones as well? Yeah. They're all yeah. heading down the motion path now, which scares me. It you scares get that for PlayStation so 3 as well. It scares me so bad. Do you want to open these or do you want to open these? Oh, this is just a book. Just a book, yeah. This is just the quick start guide. I don't, don't think you need to open that up. So you know, there's a headset. That's the head. Ooh, it's got volume control on it. Apparently. So this is the headset. It just looks like a... Oh, can I take it out of here? Yeah. It's like it a looks more, like a... Wireless uh, hands-free set. Hands-free set with a mic somewhere. Where's the mic? That'll be that. That black thing there. That looks like a volume control, though. Mm. Now, that's mic on and off. Oh, unless it is just... Because there's kind of a little bit here. I don't know. Don't know. That could be the headset. It, oh, it says it's a headset, so somehow that... Technology! Mm, hopefully my old headset worked with this, because it's just a USB yeah. and wireless. I don't know if they do. I heard they don't. Because it works with a computer. Hopefully it does. Yeah, because that'll be sweet. I won't have to buy a new one. I've heard they're a bit fussy with some things. But again, I haven't really looked much into these. Power cable. Power cable! USB? Apparently it's USB 3.0. Sweet! So, it's so fast transfers. Yeah. USB and chat. Looks like the controllers take a different plug nowadays too. Oh, are you serious? But you can't use your old controllers anyway, I don't think. That looks like the, you know, the same one you use on your phone. Well, on my phone. The Android phone. Ah, oh, okay, yeah, it could be. I was going to say, I think they use Thunderbolt or something on them, or whatever they call them. Actually, I have. There you go. Yeah. Don't have to actually buy one of these. That was pathetic that the last consoles were HD and they didn't. Oh, Xbox may have, but Sony didn't give you a cord. Pathetic. This is what the boxes look like on the inside. So you've got the Sony and then everything was sort of packed in the back here. Should have showed you that, sorry. Oh, the controller. This is the video everyone's been waiting for. It actually <laughs> feels so nice. It does? Yeah. Really, I've actually been more excited about the controllers than I have the actual consoles this time. It's weird. It's really strange. 
proper feel it's about the game. Okay, I'll show you this first before I even feel it. Oh, so that's, there we go. Okay, so that's the controller, guys. We've got some backup lighting. <laughs> um, the controller, it's it's along the same lines as the original one. Ooh, shiny. You can actually plug a headset in this time. Like the Xbox. Like the original <laughs> Xbox. So I've never really experienced that, but apparently it's good. So you can still um, not need batteries or a charger or anything, but don't have to sit hell close to you. Console. That's one thing that this had over the Xbox is it's got internal rechargeable batteries, whereas with the Xbox oh. you have to buy batteries. I know, and I think that's pathetic. I think that is stupid. That it, it, they should come with fair enough if they want to keep the battery option, but come standard with the charger, and you can take that out if you want to. That should be the thing. This feels so. Oh man. And uh... heaps water. Hey, we've got an old one here. Can you sort of see? There's a fair distance. Let's try and line up one of the buttons. Look how far across the other ones are from that. It's a fair bit wider this time. Mm. But. And that works like a phone screen. The yeah, this that. is touch. And also like a laptop mouse pad. Oh, like clicking? So you can tap it. Oh, yeah, it's a button. Mm. So that is actually a button, guys. Sorry, I'm trying to hold it and look at it at the same time. Whoa, this is... I'm sorry, Xbox, but this controller is better than yours. I felt I felt the Xbox One controller the other night, and it is awesome. I'm not, I'm a, it's hard because I'm a Sony fan, so really I'm giving a Sony fan opinion. But the new Xbox controller ruled. I thought when I grabbed it, first impressions were so good. The bumpers were, I found too hard to press. They were in an awkward position. And after playing Killer Instinct, which was the game I was most excited for, the D-pad is way better because Xbox have the worst D-pad when it comes to fighting games. Now they've fixed that and they've given it a proper D-pad which doesn't have joining bits except for it's glossy. Um, how do you feel the difference between the triggers and that? Oh yeah, so they're, they're glossy buttons, which means after a bit of a fighting game, your fingers sort of start to get sweaty, and it's hell slippery. I don't know why they did that. Actually, these quite feel quite slippery, but they're not glossy, so I don't think it's going to have the same problem. Oh, like, it's just... The triggers feel so nice. <clears throat> actually, it all feels hell good. And the uh, thumb pads, the th they've got holes so your hands don't slip. Yeah, that's good. Because originally I didn't think that bothered me. So these ones used to be rounded where the new ones have got... Uh, it's a bit hard to see. Because you've probably seen them on the net. They've got a little... <laughs> what am I doing? What am I doing? They've got little indents now so your fingers don't slide off and they feel so good. Mm. <laughs> Lovely. And they've got buttons here. This is so good. This is a bit strange though, how they put this light on here. I think it's infrared or something, it's, it connects to the console somehow. But um, after watching good games, so I don't know much about them, but good games said in some games it'll show you health, things yeah. like that, which you can't see when you're holding it. I don't know if it's like they said, we're meant to reflect off the screen, which seems a little silly. I don't know. Mm. Lights are pretty. <laughs> Chuck lights on a console makes them pretty. Yeah. Pretty! Alright. The D-pad even sort of dips in at the middle, which is so comfortable. This is really good D-pad. For fighting games, I still use the D-pad, and that is so good. I haven't tried it, but like, it feels like it's going to be hell, hell good. Oh, look, and you can't see it because it's so dark. It's so dark. <laughs> yeah, I'll get mine. Watch out while you hold it. Oh, you've got a torch. Yeah, sorry about the lighting again, guys. It's terrible. Look at it! This looks hell nice. Again, I, was, I wasn't unhappy with the Xbox when I saw it. Everyone said it was massive. It is massive, but it does look good. It's weird they've both gone with the same, des like it's almost like they're the same yeah. company made them this time. Like Xbox has got rid of their whole white. Oh, they used to be black actually. The original Xbox was black. Oh, shiny logos. Shiny logos. Uh, USB ports are in the hole. Sweet. Oh, you can't even see them when they're not there. That's sick. Where's the game go? Oh, in there? And so the slip for the game is right here. Yeah. Also, as far as I know, I think this is a light. Yeah. Wing! Apparently, because that, that, all that fan's there, mm -hmm. um, that's where the airflow isn't. You know, oh. it'll be in the back of your, yeah. your thing, but apparently they run really cold. 
Because that's what everyone's saying, it's a bit scary because the Xbox is massive for, ma for major airflow kind of thing to solve their dying issues that they used to have. And then Sony's sort of made their console really small, so hopefully they haven't stung themselves a bit. Like I said, I don't know much about them, I know they're both having issues at the moment, but every new console has issues, that's just how. Well, not all of them won't, but you know what I mean. Mm. They have... Like, I've, I've bought old Sonys that are like far into it and they still occasionally have stuffed up. So fingers crossed this one doesn't. Well, Steve's one hasn't. Oh, has he got one? Yeah, he's been playing Knack all day. I don't know anything about Knack. Neither do I. <laughs> <laughs> so informative. This is so informative. Not many uh, ports on the back though, considering the Xbox, I think I saw the back and it's just like... Yeah. Port City. But like, they don't need it. It's all USB. Yeah, yeah, and it doesn't... It doesn't do TV as much. <laughs> so you didn't buy it to watch the TV. It's, it's, not, it's, a, a, it's not, a, not an entertainment hub, it's a yeah, PlayStation. It's a PlayStation. It's a gaming console. Uh, I heard you can actually play games sometimes on the Xbox. They didn't really advertise it. No. <laughs> but yeah, so hopefully it's good. I like the Xbox. I like them both this time. Do you have a PlayStation uh, Plus account? No. And you need one. I've got one. And it oh, carries over. That's good, that's, that's good. excellent. I used to bag having to have an account on Xbox, but you've got to do it on Sony now. But you're getting benefits. They give you free games and stuff. So. Oh, yeah. Um, and you don't have to pay for anything else, whereas Xbox, you have, like, you've got different levels of subscription. Yeah. Fair enough. So, like, you can get Netflix on it's... here. Free, you just have to pay for the movies. Yeah. Can we do Netflix? Yeah. Is it all in the apps? Cool. Cool. Hey, look at me in there! Ha <laughs> um, Anyway, so guys, this has been the <laughs> unboxing of a PS4. Hasn't been tried yet, but yeah, this is the unboxing. This is the controller. It is sexy. Mmm. That's sexy. Mmm. Talking about the controller. Not so bad. <laughs> anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'm Sad City Clown. An expensive. Gotcha. First guest, first guest episode. So hit a like and subscribe, and um, I'll catch you all in the next video. So I see the clown out.